so guys welcome back again to my channel welcome back to a country where is premium or nothing so guess what they is budgeted 250 million naira to decorate first ladies event that is the open term that is Tinibu's wife how much did i say i said 250 million that's what they spent just to decorate a hall you see that i posted the video where they spent 158 million to renovate a toilet so now it's now 250 million to decorate a single hall for an event so Tinibu led presidency spends 250 million on decorations for first lady events no fewer i don't, I don't know why, they, why this one is funny no fewer than five payments within days we are made for the decoration of state banquet hall Sheraton hotel and for decoration for the first lady programs by the president bola Tinibu led nigeria government between march 11 between march 15 and july 15 2024 the payment sum summed to a total of 250 million within those five days all the payments we are made to one organization rock, rock of ages total events review of the payments of the payment portal showed that on july 15 2024 the house the state house paid 68.4 million in respect of decoration on democracy day this payment was made to rock of ages total event center on the 5th of july another sum of 19.9 .9 million was paid for decoration of a 300 seater hall at the charlatan hotel then on the 24th may 2024 the sum of 131.9 million was paid for full-scale decoration for state house events for face lady program for women youth and children another payment was recorded on 17th may to be two to the tune of 22.5 million for the decoration of the state house new banquet hall breaking fast and fresh flowers in the cec that command in chief office for three days on the 15th of march the government paid 7.5 million for the decoration of the state house state house banquet hall and then they have been consigned on an state of expenditure with calls for more prudence and accountability in the management of the country's scarce resources so despite the scarce um resources we have in nigeria that's why the hunger in nigeria this is what our leaders are being are spending our money on and yes nigerians have known to bury money so that is they have money to pay for all these but yes they're still bring money and they claim that without money in nigeria then where are they getting money to pay 250 million for the decoration where are they getting money to pay 158 million to renovate a toilet where are they getting money to renovate um the vp's house where are they getting money to buy private jet for, for the president and all these things are costing in billions of naira, not in millions of naira. which if they take the, the citizens if they have the, if they have us in mind at least a little token from those money would have helped to solve a problem getting those money together and build a company that can employ thousands of youth is the best thing the government can do taking blood of naira to invest in agriculture or to tackle securities in this nigeria is the best thing our government can do for us but guess what they are busy spying sp spending money on unnecessary things because i don't see this is why you're spending millions of naira to decorate a hall just to have an event where your people are hungry where the people you are leading are very very hungry you are spending such an amount of money in decoration you are buying private jets just to travel where you have you can you have a jet in Nigeria, we have already old ones, but no, you want to get new one for the president. They are they are renovating a VP's house with a billion of naira. Billions of naira. They are commissioning roads with billions of naira. Everything they're doing is are running in billions, which means if you calculate them, they are running in trillions of naira. And that's the country that said that they don't have money, a country that not produces rather than the consume. Nigeria is known to be a country that consumes and not produce, produces because if you don't produce and you consume at the end you still look forward to consume and you not see it that's the good thing about pro production and people be as a good man with a good heart have come out to advise this government that they should try very well to be working on production we don't, we don't have any company that produces anything we import almost every goods that we use in nigeria from outside and that's why it's affecting our economy you pay we import all those things you don't have any producing company in nigeria you don't have anything in nigeria you don't have agriculture in nigeria because right now 
that nobody is not going to because the headsmen have taken over the land. Tell me how Nigeria can get better with this thing. And now they stopped Binance operation in Nigeria, thinking that it was the reasons for the downfall of Naira. But guess what? That's not the reason. The main reason is that Nigeria doesn't produce, we only import. And if you are know like, importing, you are making the dollar stronger, which means the dollar will keep getting value rather that than Naira. And that means we'll be getting, we'll be, Naira will be depreciating and the economy will be getting more harder. So I think the government should just pick up and know what to do about this. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to air your views about this video you watch, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay tuned, guys.